too. For today's video, Ruger. What are you doing? And welcome back to today's video. We're gonna be doing a quick clean and running around the house before we pack up our trailer to head out camping for the weekend. Now you guys are actually going to be watching this when we get back, but I wanted to pick up the camera and kind of show you guys my process of a really quick kind of swiftly go through the house type of clean, not a deep clean, um, because I feel like these are very realistic and relatable style videos. We don't always have hours in the day to deep clean our home. Sometimes it's just a surface level clean and that's it. So I hope you guys find a lot of value in this one. Also today's video is a collaboration with my friend Lizzie, which I will tell you guys a little bit more about in just a few minutes, but let's go ahead and just dive right into today's video. As I mentioned just a second ago, I have a lot to tackle on my list today. So I wanted to really get moving and I decided to go ahead and start here in the kitchen today. I knew that there was a lot going on in here that I wanted to get done. I never love to leave the house for a few days knowing that there's dishes in the sink or trash in the trash can or crumbs on the counter, things like that. I love to just give it a fresh little um, quick surface clean before we head out and then it's also just so nice to come home to knowing that you don't have You know a bunch of dishes and trash and laundry to come back to so that's where we're gonna be working on today's video So let's go ahead and take care of these dishes I would love to hear from you guys down in the comments to see if you are like me and you love to go through your house and do a quick cleanup before you go. Um, I know some people don't mind just like heading out of the house and then there's others like me that just love to have everything in its place before you go so it's just less stressful to come home to. I would love to know which one you guys are honestly down below in the comments. Let me know if you guys are cleaners before vacation or do you just kind of let it go and deal with it when you get back home. Trust me, I won't let you down. I am busting out my favorite cleaner here in the kitchen and that is Barkeeper's Friend. I feel like this cleaner is so handy. Um, I even found that it works great in tubs and showers, but having this white kitchen sink, it has just really been a lifesaver. Getting a bunch of the stains up and maybe if I had a pan at the bottom, it left a rust mark, it brings all that right out. Um, I also love to do spot cleaning on my quartz countertops if there was like um, a stain or anything on my white counters. I will just get a sponge, use a little bit of Barkeeper's Friend with a little bit of water and it scrubs right up. So, and it's such a cheap cleaner too and so versatile. So highly, highly recommend Barkeeper's Friend. And so I'm just using hot water and then the Barkeeper's Friend to just refresh my sink because it was definitely looking pretty dingy. I would love to introduce you all to my sweet friend Lizzie and her YouTube channel on here is It's Lizzie and I actually reached out to her to ask if she wanted to collab. She actually took a slight YouTube break for a few months 
um, because she had some major life changes going on, but she is back and better than ever. She just moved into her brand new apartment and she has been just decorating and organizing and cleaning and making it all her own. I'm so proud of her. Um, she has a very similar channel to mine. So make sure you guys go over and say hello to Lizzie and welcome her back to YouTube and make sure you leave her a comment and let her know that you guys came over from my channel. I feel like I'm always in my kitchen. There's always dishes in the sink. There's always counters to be wiped down and floors to be cleaned, but I know I'm going to miss it someday. So I'm doing my best to embrace it and just soak up all of the family time because I know you guys, I feel like life just keeps going by faster and faster. My kids, I swear, are just growing up quicker and quicker every single year. And it is just so freaky to witness. Um, so I'm really just trying to more so soak up these messes and memories in the home because I know before I know it, they will be grown and out of the house and then I will really, really miss the chaos and all the messes. Um, but I really am still in the stage with the age of my kids where I have to get down to their level and really wipe down walls and you know the chairs where they eat and there's just always sticky little fingers and crumbs everywhere. So that's what I'm working on in this space. Um, they eat a lot of their meals right here, and I just thought this was the perfect job for my tin coat. This actually vacuums and mops all in one, and it is such a huge time saver. I was also running a lot of errands to go out of town today. So I went to the grocery store and in between doing all that, I was doing all this cleaning and the laundry. Of course we need fresh clothes to pack. So I'm just kind of uh, moving laundry through in the background of today's video um, while I move through the downstairs of the house and the boys are currently upstairs. Um, I have them picking up the loft area and their bedrooms and then I'm gonna go up there and start packing for the day. But um, really quickly, I wanted to share, I have worked with Cricut a few times and I have a couple of their machines and I thought I would go ahead and pass this machine over to a girlfriend of mine so she can enjoy it. So I had to go put that out for her to come pick up. And then um, really quickly want to share these flowers I actually got for my birthday a couple weeks ago and I have not killed them. So here you guys are witnessing me watering some of my plants and I'm so happy I have kept them alive all this time. The kitchen island and the sideboard here in the dining room are definitely a catch-all space for us where we just kind of plop things down and it can get really piled up in here. Um, so I'm taking the time to um, clear off the sideboard in here. Um, I was also staging some stuff by the front door to take out to the trailer. So you guys just saw me box up a pizza stone that I bought for our oven out in our travel trailer. I guess you put in a pizza stone it helps distribute the heat more evenly because a lot of times in RVs, their ovens just don't cook through evenly. A lot of times it'll be like frozen in the middle and burnt on the outside, but I learned that little hack. So if you guys have a motorhome or a trailer or RV of some sort, try the pizza stone. I got it just on Amazon. I'll do my best to link it down below. Um, but yeah, it's supposed to be a nice little hack. So I wanted to share that. But I'm just clearing off all these surfaces, getting everything wiped down, everything being put away where it needs to be. 
This front door area is definitely another catch-all space in our home. My husband came home from work and immediately went straight out front to go hook up the trailer and do all that fun stuff so I can start loading it later tonight. And so I told him just get out there, get it done, and I will go ahead and clear up all this space and all of his stuff um, that he brings in from work for the day. You guys have seen my channel before you probably noticed that the exercise bike has moved its way from our gym area in the kitchen in the kitchen in the garage to our living room area um, and we just decided to go ahead and move it in here just temporarily to see if we would actually use it more if it was in the house um, and we had just brought it in at this point so we were definitely using it more but it was very dusty from being in our garage gym. So I'm just gonna take a minute to wipe all this down because it had a pretty hefty layer of dust on it. While I'm cleaning here in the family room, I thought this would be a great time to go ahead and welcome you all to my channel. If maybe it's your first time here, maybe you came over from Lizzie's channel. Hello, I am so happy you guys are here. It always means so much to me when I get a new subscriber or anytime I see you guys watching my videos or um, talking and leaving me comments and liking my videos. It's seriously, I just will never ever get over it. It's just, mind-blowing to me how you guys take time out of your busy lives to support my channel and hang out with me but i'm katie and i am a lifestyle lifestyle channel and i do a lot of homemaking i love homemaking and taking care of my family so you will see a lot of cleaning organizing decluttering um cooking decorating home re like room refreshes um, a little bit of home life i don't share a whole lot of my personal life on here um but I do um, share things here and there. Um, I'm in Southern California. I'm a boy mom to two boys. Um, I have a nine, almost 10 year old, and then an eight year old. Um, and we are on summer break still, but we are getting ready to go back. We are actually what you call a year round schedule here where we live. We actually get only two months in the summer and then we get a full month in the winter. So it kind of breaks up the break. Um, a little bit during the school year and we love it so we're getting ready to go back here um next week that you guys are seeing this video so lots of gearing up for back to school lots going on and then of course um, my favorite time on youtube is getting into the holidays i love doing um halloween and fall and christmas um so that'll be coming up here in the next couple months so I would love to have you guys here on my channel and consider subscribing before you leave today. I would absolutely love to have you.
are really moving and grooving in today's video. We got the kitchen and dining room area picked up and then even went into the family room and got that cleaned up and everything is looking really nice. But the last space that I really want to tackle um, before I start packing and loading the trailer for the day is this downstairs bathroom. Again, love to wipe down my bathrooms before we leave and just come home to a nice clean house. And that way all I have to do is really worry about throwing the laundry in the laundry room and in the wash and relaxing because often after you come home from being away, you need a vacation from your vacation. So we're gonna clean up this bathroom area, get the toilet all scrubbed and then clean up the floors. And then um, to finish up today's video, I am gonna bust out my vacuum and vacuum up the stairs. Every time I'm editing a new video, it kind of gives me flashbacks to previous videos. So looking at the vanity here in the bathroom, I love just knowing that um, I came in here, we emptied this out together, we threw a ton of stuff away, a whole pile of stuff, and got it all reorganized. So it's just nice to know that not only just the main part of the bathroom is clean, but just knowing that the cabinet is all organized and it just feels so good to go through your home, just one drawer, one cabinet, one closet at a time. And before you know it, it just really adds up and feels really, really nice. Um, if you guys missed my last video, make sure you guys go check that out because we went through my guest bedroom, which can easily turn into my hoarding space where I love to just shut things and shut the door and it got a little out of hand again. So we went in there and did that and so I'm happy to report that it's all still fresh and clean and nice and is its purpose as a guest bedroom and not a oversized storage closet. you enjoyed today's video I hope you found a ton of motivation in this quick clean I love going around my house doing a really quick clean right before any time we leave on a trip or a vacation it's so nice to come back to a clean house clean sheets and just have less to do other than just unpack so if you guys enjoyed it I would hope if you could hit that like button before you leave today also please do not forget to subscribe and also please go over and say hello to my friend Lizzie now that you're done watching this video give her a warm hello tell her you came over from my channel and even consider subscribing and if you guys are here from Lizzie's channel I hope you guys will also consider subscribing before leaving today. I'm so happy you all are here. Thank you again so much for hanging out with me today and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye friends. <laughs>